Uh, this is Gary Topmiller. I live on the Emory River. And the way it used to look was so pretty out here. But now I'm going to show you pictures of how our dock and the river around our dock looks since the TVA watch bar spill. Uh, you can see that uh, a lot of the centispheres are on the water. And when the water goes down, this is left on our banks. And you can see how it lays on the banks from that tire there. As the water goes down, it dries on the banks, it blows in our houses, and this is a continuous mess. And TVA has promised to clean this up, but this is a daily occurrence on our side of the river. We are right across from TVA while they're doing their cleanup. This is my wife, this is her eyes. Her eyes would swell shut an average of twice a week and needed doctor's care before we put filters in our house. This is some of the dead animals we found floated up on, on the banks of our river. Uh, we've seen birds completely fall out of the trees. Um, the fish was numerous. Now we've just taken these pictures for the last couple months. So you can see that it's still an ongoing problem out here. Uh, there's, there's dead animals all over this place and uh, TVA chooses not to, not to address the problem. Um, of course our dogs can, can drag animals up, but now the birds and the possums and the, they're, they're making their way here somehow, squirrels. So you can see that this is definitely a problem. There's a vehicle that's parked out there where the wind hits it from the, the fly ash spill.